There have been thousands of generous women who have donated samples to the Women's Health Tissue Repository at the University of Iowa, which I direct. These samples are used to help advance women's, women's health research. So for a long time, women were left out of many studies. And so there are things that we don't understand, such as labor. And women have been getting pregnant for a really long time, but we still don't know things that can trigger labor or ways that maybe some better ways that we could help stop it. And so we can use samples that these women donate along with their clinical information to help us understand all areas of, of a woman's life and all stages of it, um, whether it be infertility, pregnancy, or cancer. And so we ask women during their care to let us have access to their medical record and then to have a little bit extra of samples. So if she's getting a blood draw, we get a little bit extra. Another tube is popped down for us. So it's very easy for women to do this. And other things get donated like cord blood or placenta or pieces of tumor. Um, so it's really very easy for them. And we use these samples to help us in our research, not only my research, but in others, in our collaborators, to move this area of, of women's health research forward. So for example, women still die from pregnancy and from pregnancy-related complications. And this doesn't just happen in third world countries, it still happens in the US. And we want to stop this from ever happening. Pregnancy is supposed to be a really happy time in families' lives. And if we can use these samples and this information to help stop that from happening, then we will really have honored the generosity of the women who have donated to the bank.